If like me, you shoot a lot of video and you have to keep making folder after folder after folder just to keep things organized, then this is the video you want to watch if you would like to automate that. What's up guys, MGZ here, here to show you guys how to automate the creation of folders inside of Windows. It's pretty simple and once you do it, you'll be able to replicate it over and over again for different types of uh, folder titles. So the first thing you want to do is open some type of Word document processor. You can use uh, Notepad if you want, but right now I'm having problems with saving Notepad documents, so I will use WordPad. Anything that can create a plain text document will work just fine. Notepad, Word doc, WordPad, uh, Microsoft Word, all of these will work. So the first thing you want to type are the letters M, D, and then you hit space. Now, after that, this is where you put the title of the folder that you would like to create. So for this example, I'm going to use the word music. Now, all you want to do is go to File, Save As, and if you're using WordPad or Microsoft Word like I am, make sure it is plain text document, and it will save it as a .txt. This is important. You want it to be in that format. So save it to the desktop. Uh, let's just call it... It doesn't really matter what you call this file. I'm just going to do this for the tutorial sake. Auto folders. .txt. It's going to ask you, are you sure you want this? The formatting will be removed. That's just fine. Click yes. So we can exit out of that right now. And as you can see right here, here's the auto folders.txt. If I open it in Notepad, it says MD space music, which is exactly what we want. Now you want to come over to the file and either click on it once until it's highlighted and click on it again or hit F2 this will bring up the renaming format you want to get rid of rid of the txt don't get rid of the dot delete the txt and type in BAT and hit enter this will turn it into a batch file it's gonna ask you would you are you sure you want to rename the file extension it might become unusable this is fine this is exactly what we want hit yes as you can see the icon change now whenever you double click this look what happens it automatically created a folder named music there's nothing in it because we didn't tell it to put anything in it but it automatically created it so I can click it again and okay and since it's still there it doesn't make a copy like normal but if I double click it after deleting it it makes another one let's say we can go even more advanced than this let's say we want to create that folder but have folders inside of that folder and if you really want to very deep into this you can have folders inside of those folders inside of those folders etc you get my drift so let's open it back up I'm going to rename this to um, let's just name it title okay so if you want to make more folders you just hit enter type in the letters MD if you want another folder created alongside the first folder, which in this case is called title, you would create that title of that folder here. But if you want a folder inside of the first folder, you would type title backslash and then whatever that folder would be. So let's say you're doing video and you want to have separate folders for your video, for your audio, and for the folders that may all go into the project. So we'll have video and then we want an audio folder so we do title again backslash uh, photos and then MD again title I don't know if case matters you know uppercase or lowercase and then we want audio so you just come up here hit save and I always double check to make sure edit okay it did save now we either double click or hit enter on that batch file again as you can see here's the folder called title we renamed it we made it title and inside of that folder is video photos and audio just like we want uh, that's the basics of it if you want to go further and put folders inside these folders you basically follow the same thing you go title and then let's say for example the videos folder and you want say you're shooting with multiple cameras cam 1 cam 2 cam 3 you would just continue doing that inside of here 
you know, you follow the hierarchy, title, video, slash, cam one, and then title, slash, video, slash, cam two, you would just continue to do that, and you can do this unlimitedly. It will create every single folder that you want. If you thought that was awesome, please hit the thumbs up button. And if you want to see more tutorials just like this one, make sure you hit that subscribe button below as I will be putting out tutorials and tip videos every single Wednesday. See you in the next video, guys. Peace.